Hey, it's Sam here from Guitar.com. I'm with Chris over at Dean, and we're taking a look at the new updated Exile series. So, Chris, what can you tell us about this? Well, this is new for 2020. This is a, a body shape that we've done over the years, and now we've decided to make it a little bit more for everybody for a high-performance player. With a, We have it in six and seven strings um, with a burl top or a quilt maple top. It has a 16-inch flat fretboard radius, but with a flat C neck shape, so really just for the high shred. 5766 TW in brushed chrome, and they're all tappable, so you can turn them into splits. And as well, it has a very high access cutaway. Eric. Yep. <laughs> Step in, Eric. Step in. Yeah, so the cool thing that we did, we had, uh, we had this guitar put in the line, uh, you know, um, a while ago, so we had the similar body shape. Um, it's just it's a simple three-way switch. Obviously, Chris said the coil taps. Uh, everything is multi-bound. That's the other thing that we like to do in all the select series. We put ebony fingerboards on them. We multi-bind Grover tuners. And then, obviously, over here, you can see the natural one. Uh, what I wanted to show you, so we'll, we'll scoot to the select series because, obviously, the Exiles are bolt-ons, but our select series... Our majority of them are set neck, set through neck actually. Um, this is a 12 inch radius with ebony fingerboard. On every piece that we do, MLs, Vs, Zs, caddies, uh, thoroughbreds, we have a beautiful quilt top on them, five ply bound bodies, uh, Floyd Rose 1000s, our own uh, Seymour Duncan uh, custom pickups for us. So are these pickups custom wound specifically for Dean? Uh, they're not custom wound for Dean, but they are our own proprietary look. So we have the parchment zebra, we have sandblasted pole pieces, and it's a, what is it? It's a, we have a custom and a custom. an Alnico Pro, but they just have our aesthetic to them that we have exclusively. Yeah, see, because I can never remember everything that we do. <laughs> <laughs> Again, Grover tuners, uh, matching quilt, uh, headstock veneer, multi-bound on the top. And then we sat and finish all the back of the necks on every one of them, so it doesn't, you know, some people don't like that glossy feel because it can, you know, your hands can get yeah, stuck so on it. Every going. select series we yeah. make, whether it be bolt on or set through, all have a satin finish on the back of the neck. And, jum and jumbo frets too, yeah. jumbo frets. Uh, then we did the MD. This is an MD24. Chris here, hand, take that. So this is an MD24, 24 fret. It's a long scale, right, Chris? 25 yeah. and a half. Long scale, 25 and a half. Floyd Rose 1000, one volume, one three-way toggle. Keep it simple. Again, you know, our Seymour Duncan pickups in here. Same, that's on all the select series. Ebony fingerboard. Uh, Grover tuners. Again, bound neck, bound headstock. And the new old logo that we put back on here because my buddy Chris here was play playing in Deicide and people come up to him, dude, guitar sounds great. That's awesome. What is it? Because <laughs> yeah. they couldn't see our old logo on it. So we've had this logo. It, it definitely has lineage to Dean Guitars, and we decided to put it back on here, do a little mm -hmm. tweak to it, and upgrade it so people know what's on stage and know what's being played and know what sounds kick-ass. Again, three-piece maple quarters on neck, you know, bolt-on, ready to rock. And then if you don't like Floyd's, you can get it with the Cadillac tailpiece, which is our tailpiece, very historic all the way back to 1980. So this is ours. Well, can you tell us more about that tailpiece? Because as you said, it's so historic and so vital to the Dean it brand. It's a different look, but it's very high mass, so it actually holds a resonance and just really holds everything down really well. And it just looks cool. In all honesty, this thing's badass. So is that something that people can spec out when purchasing the guitar, or is it specific to each model? It's specific yeah. to um, most anything with a, with a hard t most things with a hard tail. Great. Thanks, Eric. Thanks, Chris. You got it. See more from Dean over on guitar.com.